So Newcastle away up next. There's only one point between you in the table, so not much of a difference on the pitch, but off the pitch there is a vast difference in finances. Would you be envious of those finances? Uh, if you only speak about the finances, in you know, I, of course, we know in football, uh, money talks. It, it, it's a very in, in, important part. Uh, the, 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 uh, the, that's one thing. But the very good news is that it's not only about money, but over time, of course, it's very difficult to compete against um, the, the big, big money. That's why we, we talk about big six. It's not only because of their histories and uh, the size of club, but mainly because they just have a l much larger budget than, than anyone else. Newcastle want to, to challenge that and there's no doubt that Newcastle are aiming to be a, a top six and maybe we need to talk about a, a top seven. Talk about that in the, in, in the future. Uh, but put, put that aside uh, and then, then so us being what? A bottom two budget club in the, in, in the league is, is remarkable what we're doing uh, in many ways. Um, but that aside, I would like to praise uh, Eddie Howe and his coaching staff and the players. I think they've done a, a, a very good uh, job so far. First last year by stabilizing the club and this year I think they have only lost to Liverpool. Uh, looking very strong, dynamic, physical, aggressive, um, and especially at home at St. James's Park, you know, one of the most difficult away grounds to go to. But we offer the chance and we are looking forward to it and we'll do our very best to attack and we'll go up there with the best intention and uh, of, of getting three points. And in a few years' time, do you still see Newcastle and Brentford being around the same level? If we have the money we have now, and they have the money, and we continue doing that. If uh, if we are the same level at that time, it will be an even more, an even bigger miracle than it is now that we are uh, competing. Yeah, I think he he made them much more front footer aggressive. I think they they press very aggressive uh, and forward, very very organised in that pressure. I think that that's a that's a big thing. Um, Secondly, uh, uh, on the ball, uh, they look very dynamic. Play with uh, two eights in Jolington and uh, Wilson is very not Wilson Willock. Uh, that is very um, uh, dynamic and running forward and and you know very good. Uh, so the way they uh, they play and run uh, behind uh, the opponents is 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 very. Very impressive. Um, so I like the I like the way they play. And what is it like being at St James's Park? You, you mentioned there that, of course, it is one of the biggest and toughest grounds to go to. No, it's it's it's, it's a, in, in many ways it's a great experience, uh, but it's only small glimpses where I can either enjoy it or actually being you know like, oh it's quite nice, it's crazy atmosphere. But after uh, you know you're normally just in it and and try to figure out a way to uh, to win the game or the next move uh, and so on.